See the bumblebees, carpenter bees, a lot of them, I think. They've got that bald spot on the back. What I've noticed today, first time I've seen it, is uh, what I'm calling a bully bee. Bully bees. And this is bees that are in the territorial mode. They'll sit there and hover around the flowers and, and whatnot. Uh, they don't directly excuse all the waving please I'm trying to find one in action but they don't bother another bee while it's on the flower um, this bully bee phenomenon I've seen uh, and it seems to be just one, maybe two of these guys. They, uh, when one goes to flip from one flower to another, the bully bee will attack. And often they end up on the, they end up on the, flower that the uh, bee that is being bullied was on or going to. Of course now that I'm wanting to record this behavior I'm not seeing it. That's always the story with uh, nature and nature photography videos. It just takes patience. But I'm looking for, my, the, the big one is when I see one, uh, big clue, I'll see a bee hovering. And he'll be checking out the ones, there are other bees that are on the flowers. And uh, you can tell he, I mean, I watched him sit there and hover near a feeding bee for probably 15, 20 seconds. And he backed off. And then when the feeding bee went to switch flowers, he attacked the feeding bee as soon as the feeding bee landed on another flower. Now I say attack, for all I know it's mating. However, it was a bigger bee on a little bee, which would not be typical, since the females are typically the larger and not the male. However, I can't say I'm, well, I'm not totally knowledgeable about carpenter bees. Uh, they don't really hive up or gather or congregate in swarms or groups, though they might during the winter. Uh, they tend to just be solitaries. They uh, pretty much will find them a little hidey hole something like that uh, holes in the wood or under the bark and I found them in the morning they'll be like tucked under the flowers now we've got a different species of bee that looks like a miniature bumblebee and for all I know it's the same species and just a different uh, you know juvenile or or uh, you know, hadn't gotten its growth, but uh, typically they don't leave the hive or wherever the heck they come from until they're about full size, or at least that's what I've always understood. Fighting their way through the flowers. Not an easy task, apparently. And as I said, now that I'm looking for the fighting uh, behavior, the bully behavior that I saw previously, I'm not seeing it. And it's really odd because I've witnessed, you know, two bees foraging on the same flower, no argument, not at all. Uh, but I did note that one bee seemed to take notice of the other, 
and I flew off first and kind of hovered for a second and flew on to another flower. But, uh, like most nature things, this is not something that uh, you can just tap on command and there you go, you have a show. I did notice though that uh, you know they get into this almost like predatory mode it was the larger ones slightly larger than the other ones not that much same species just a bully bee a bigger bee that attacks the other bees oh and look what we got there and he he's busy doing his little thing too that's good. Them little guys eat a lot of little bugs. Just need to eat more mosquitoes. Pretty cool. That's a juvenile. He ain't too old. Uh, smart enough not to mess with the bee. And off he goes. Back on the hunt. Well, this behavior I witnessed obviously is not occurring. Uh, don't you know it? It's the way it goes. Uh, when you want it, it ain't there. And when I ain't got my camera, then then it'll be happening all around me. But that's that's the uh, truth of it. People don't quite understand patience anymore. True patience. notice that quite a bit instant gratification press a button and, and there it is which is what you're looking for you're looking for that bee battle <coughs> I've decided to make you suffer and wait just like I have to watching the stupid bees come on y'all well Here we have a yellow jacket coming in, or a wasp. What is he? He's some type of wasp. Not sure what type. Looks yellow jackety, but it's not a yellow jacket. Uh, yellow jackets are uh, very much disliked around here. Um, they get aggressive. They give you a nasty sting. For me, I'll get a welt and a muscle ache that lasts for about four days at the sting site, like I got bruised. Saw that old lizard hop around, that little lizard. He ain't old at all. So far, no battling bees. I don't see the bullies bullying. There's the lizard. He's creeping around through there. Back behind that brick now. Well, folks, I hate to be a disappointment, but uh, just call me life, eh? Wouldn't that be cool if I could get that fight this close? But I don't see my fighter anywhere anymore. Oh, well, that's the brakes.